Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're back playing Grit and Valor 1949. So I am a, if anyone's curious where I've been, um, kind of been sick. So, so yeah, for a while, obviously issues with family, things like that going on. Um, that's the main reason. And then after that, I was like, oh yeah, okay, everything's fine now, everything's chilled, I can get back into recording. Well then we had some issues with just actually like where we live and everything, and the neighbors, and more family stuff, and then more issues, and then I got sick, and yeah, I'm having a great time so far. Um... So we're going to try to kind of remember how to play this game. Hopefully I can kind of remember how to play this game a little bit. It has been a while. Nice. These should. Yep. Nice. Okay. Nothing to worry about. Oh, come on. I feel like that should have been a ballistic kill, but whatever. Or ballistic. Is this ballistic? I don't remember. I don't fully remember which one was ballistic. Okay, yeah, this guy's ballistic. Okay, that makes sense. Oh yeah, that guy's explosive. The other guy is whatever the other thing is. Okay. Ballistic, ballistic. Um, damage resistance. We're on high ground. Yeah, we'll go with that. Increase their damage resistance. I feel like that's pretty good. Okay, let's look at this. Okay, so plan is go pro obviously here. Probably go here, 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 here. That's the plan. We're gonna hope we can stick to it, but we'll see how it goes. Uh, just drink some water. Okay. Yes, Commander. Acknowledged. We ready for action. I'm gonna put you behind that barrier there. <laughs> Probably put this guy back here as well. Or just like, just right there, shall I? Okay, nice. Yeah, this should be good. I don't think we we honestly haven't really had to use any of our abilities yet, which I mean makes a lot of sense. I wouldn't expect us to have to use any abilities yet, but this is a nice spot as well. 
like very very nice little area because if they come from this way or this way we can just go here if they come from this way or that way we can just put them here it's a very easy to defend uh, terrain which is really nice Coming from this way, there's a little bit less defense, but not too worried about it. Got the objective. Yeah, range is pretty massive in this game, I feel like. Like I feel I really do feel like range is very important. Because if you can outrange their units, like then you're in a very good position. Uh, that's what I was trying to avoid there, but it's fine. Fire makes deal critical damage. Moving. Yeah, let's go with that. The chance to heal, I think it's going to be good. Next day, gain 75 black coins. Or I could just obtain an enhancement. Yeah, let's just obtain an enhancement. Ooh, all your fire mechs are on high ground. Their movement speed is on is increased. Okay. Sure. Defend the civilian tents. Okay. Which way are they coming from? No, I don't want you to. <clears throat> the explosive, I really wish this guy could actually like lead his, his shots, because he really can't. <laughs> no, don't go that way, go this way. Actually, I'll probably just put you over here. Yeah, good job, guys. You bombed your own guys. Well done. Okay. Nice. That went very well. That went very well. Artifacts are moving while your fire mics are in cover. Damage is increased. Ooh, yeah. 
Gain ability charges, gain 50 black coins. Uh, probably just 50 black coins. I feel like that's probably better. Do I need to repair? Maybe a little bit, but... It's, I mean, it's a scavenger, but so I don't actually have to get a repair. The quality of one of your enhancements at random. No enhancement of any quality. We'll go with that. We'll go with that. Cover, oh, yeah, that's the... Oh, and that's the one that got improved. It was actually that one. Nice. That's gonna be... I feel like that's gonna be really good. Then the civilian tent. So we want to put my fire mix somewhere in cover. Oh, come on. Gotta be difficult, don't you? Nice. Dang, that's some good damage. Nice. It's just these sides that are kind of a problem. I don't really actually have any defenses for over, for like the sides here. I don't have any like, uh, cover, I should say. I think I'm just gonna put these guys right up here. Oh, I forgot that they could come from this direction. Nice. Their damage is still very good. Like, surprisingly. Oh, come on, dude. Where are you going? Bro is going in circles. Oh, this is unfortunate. Dang. We're moving. Chance to heal. Yeah. It's really buff these uh the fire mix. Nice. Dang. Objective in one wave. Nice. I wish the guys could actually kind of like, you know, do better when it comes to actually being able to move properly, like move past each other especially. 
Cause it seems like most of the time they kind of get stuck on each other. Not sure if this guy's gonna be out able to outrange my fire, my you know the, the ballistic guy there. Might be able to outrange. Yeah, he is. But it's fine because my explosive. Oh, never mind. Not exactly what I wanted happening, but it's fine. Oh, shut up! You guys are so loud. Actually, I think I'm gonna move them. Because his damage is so high, so. And he can heal as well, so. Increase that fire rate, dang. Um, I don't think I have any defenses for defending this way. Fire class again, okay, that should be easy. Destroyed that cover. I, I mean, I have defenses for that way, but. Dang, that increased fire rate is very noticeable. <laughs> Oh, 
Now, if only they could lead their shots, and then the explosive guy could actually, you know, take out some guys. He could actually do something if he actually could lead his shots. Like, he really only can attack. Sometimes he's able to hit them while they're moving if they kind of, like, stagger a little bit and then his shot is already in the air. But, uh... See, this is stuff that I don't understand. While your explosive mechs are in cover, their damage is increased by 20%. Okay, so there is some sort of condition that needs to be met in order for their damage to be increased. But then this one, your explosive mechs attacks deal increased damage and afflict tag. So this, there is no condition. This is a, just a straight up 20% increased buff plus they inflict tag. I... Like, like there's no, there's no condition, and it does the, it gives a bigger buff. Whatever. Okay. Actually, we might run them guys to the side a little bit more I think gonna have the fire guy deal most of the damage oh if they land up here that's a problem Which they are basically all landing up there. Which are not all. Oh my gosh. Landing over here is a rough spot to defend. I'm gonna have to figure out what to do about them landing over here. I think I just have to kind of like send my guys in basically. Kind of in this middle part here. The only problem is if they're in the middle here, then the guys that are drop up there are gonna have a uh, high ground advantage. But we're just gonna have to deal with it. I completely forgot this guy was over here. Yes, Commander. Acknowledged. Yeah, no, that's a bad spot You're to be in. I know he is. Look out. Critical damage. But he does repair himself. Oh no, I'm kind of falling apart here after that. Oh my gosh, okay. Uh, 
Okay, yeah, let's go with that. Yeah, we have a lot of money. I'll just go with that. This guy's the fastest guy that I have, so... Nice. Yeah, if they get grouped up as well, that's a that's a time when this guy can actually land his shots. Oh, that's my good. Yeah, you guys are bombing most of your guys. Half of their guys got bombed. Does it, uh, you know, <laughs> going in for like a. Oh my god, that guy. They're getting stuck. Yeah, if you're going in for an airstrike, you might not want to bomb your own guys. That doesn't seem like a very good strategy, but. What do I know? You know, there's a wall right there, but it still doesn't count as cover. Hilarious. Like you're telling me it's a it's a one that's a one way wall. <laughs> I did I forgot about those, you know, one way walls where you know they don't actually block both sides, it's only one way that they block. That's hilarious. That's actually hilarious. This is the last wave, so I'm just gonna... Dang! Yeah, he melts through the explosive mix. He, he melted. That was crazy. I think I could basically buy everything, right? Because it costs the scrap. Yeah. I have so much of that stuff. Uh, so, who do I have right now? So I have Amelia Rotten Fort, whatever. Jan Nowak and Archie Miller. Okay. So, you're useless. Um. Hers is basically, like, all healing. His is, yeah, increased range. And he is on the explosive, yeah. See, the only problem is, yes, you could increase your range, but does that matter? Archie Miller, he is on the mech jet. Well, 
Or, sorry, the ballistic, the ironclad, sorry. Um. Um. Honestly, I might switch them. Because, yes, he would be great with more range, right? But... I don't know. Ironclad doesn't really need... Does this just have one power? Yeah, it does. He doesn't really need more movement speed. Movement speed is not what we're really going for. So I'm just going to try to increase his power, I think. And that increases armor. Honestly, probably just going to go with more repair. Uh, yeah, honestly, yeah, he he's the one that needs more power. Heal amount. Here, let's look at some of these. How many? I have six blueprints. Not really what I need. I don't really care about that. Uh, I spend a lot of my black coins. That doesn't really matter. Just more damage to more health it currently has. Uh, 30% more damage? Maybe. Text deal increased damage to enemies with armor. They are here. Honestly, thinking about that. Let's look at this guy. This guy doesn't really need... This guy, what this guy needs is damage and fire rate, crit chance, things like that. That's what he needs. We're going to increase... Why, wait, why couldn't I buy that if I would? Oh, that was weird. Okay. Probably want to go for more range on that guy. And then we're going to go, like I said. We're going to switch swap them. It's 33 minutes. Okay. Almost 34, I should say. Um... So I think we have basically everything. It's all looking pretty good, I think. Come on, there we go. Wasn't letting me switch it. Yeah, increased damage. And this guy, the ironclad, is more of like tanky. I feel like this guy is gonna be more movement, speed, and damage. And then this guy is gonna be damage and fire rate. We don't really need more health. Yeah, I feel like that's pretty good. Um, yeah, I feel like that's pretty good. Should we do another one? You know, I haven't recorded a video in a while, so let's... You know what? We're going to do another run. Why not? <laughs> Just for the fun of it, let's Ready do it. Wait, um... What? Da, da, da. Huh? Did 
I do something wrong? Why is his attack range so small? That doesn't make sense. I increased his range by two tiles. I don't understand. Does this stuff only affect their abilities? I, maybe it only affects their abilities. I don't know. I, I guess it I guess maybe it only affects their abilities. I don't So that guy has three tiles. Sorry, I'm trying to figure this out because this isn't making sense to me. This guy I don't care about at all. Maybe I'm just being stupid. I mean, that could very well be the case. Yeah, I'm just being dumb. What? The... Okay. Okay. What am I missing? What am I missing? Let's... Okay, so this guy, Archie Miller. He has a range of two. Okay. Now we're gonna swap with that. And the range is the same. Okay. So yep, yeah, I think it's just the ability that it's just the abilities then that are affected by the range. Got it. Which is kind of stupid, but. Oh, that seems that's interesting. Okay. Do I want critical chance, critical damage? to do again damage and repair twenty percent damage already seems good so I do like that engine dang I really am not gonna be able to make up my mind I'm just gonna go for it
Yeah, and then we can get that for this guy. Oh wait, no, that was legs. That makes fun. What does this do again? High grade, high grade damage. And we'll figure it out. Okay. Do we have everyone where they need to be? Now that we know what stuff does. Now that we know that things don't really matter, actually. Um... It's quite literally just ability stuff that matters, like you could, which is kind of frustrating, but is what it is. Yeah, this is fine. I thought it would actually increase the range of their weapon. But actually, I'm going to switch it. We guess they're going to attack from the. Oh, okay. Okay. Okay, got it. Nice. You're telling me you can't... Maybe it, it... I guess it can't attack while it's capturing the thing. Okay. That's fine. this explosive guy going? Why are you going there? I quite literally told you to go there. Okay. Whatever. Straight up buff, you don't, there's no conditions behind it. He barely does anything anyways, I'm just gonna put him back there. so far. I, I would say that this is going very well. I haven't had too many issues yet. Ready 
obviously it could get much worse very quickly, kind of like how that other run did, where I kind of panicked a little bit, but for the most part I feel like this is going pretty good. Not where I wanted that to go. Okay. I really hate these one-way walls. We'll just leave them there. Come on, get out of the way. They're dancing. Okay, they're over there dancing. Okay. Uh, da, da, da. yeah. There we go. Upgrade enhancement. Do I have enhancements to really upgrade? What we get? Oh yeah. Okay. Go here. Basically, at all points of time, we want to take on the hardest missions because we can definitely handle diff extremely difficult missions. So I'm not really worried about it like, at all. Yeah, their guys just got completely wiped. That, see, I love that. I love that that they will just straight up bomb their own guys. Cause it's like, it's like, does that really make sense? You're bombing your own guys. Whatever. I mean, I'm not gonna be complaining. You know, if you want to bomb your own guys, you know, reduce the amount of guys that I have to. Beat, you know, go right ahead, but from a tactical standpoint, bombing your own guys does not seem, um, doesn't seem like a very good idea. <laughs> Again, what do I know, you know, I'm, the, I'm just a person playing a video game, but... Then again, if the... If, if you drop a bomb, and then, and then there's like fire on the ground, and then your guys walk into the fire, what is he doing? Okay. Yeah, if your guys then walk into the fire, I can't completely blame the airstrike, the people dropping the airstrike. Because at some point you have to be like, okay, yeah, these guys are stupid, they're literally walking in to the, the fire, like, into the fire of the airstrike. Nice. Yeah, he melts those explosive guys, so it's really good to just kind of put them right up in front. Ballistic Max. They gain increased damage for a short time. See, that's just good. Like, it's not that good, but... Let's go with that. Go here.
See, like, we can always repair. Like, repairing is not that big of a deal. Especially this guy, he just repaired a bunch of health. Your guys are dropping over here. Why are you bombing over here? Again, these are some very poor tactical positions. <laughs> and he just, yeah, 20 health. Actually, I should switch this. Come on. Okay. Might. Yeah, I'll probably do that just to kind of have them more have to, like, come this way. Come towards these guys. Okay. Except for when you have this happen. There we go. Fire guy just does so well by himself. It's like his damage is so high. So you can just kind of put him right up at right up in the front and you know. Explosive attacks deal increased damage. Go for this next. Okay, where are these guys going? Okay, right over here. Nice. Ballistic class. Okay. We need to let this guy get some shots in, some kills. So you got one. Nice. Wish he would have gotten that kill, but it's fine. Four kills so far. Good job. Good job, Mr. Mech. Enemy Ballistic Mech. They got a long ways to go, so I'm not too worried. Oh, 
out here and get the kills. Because we have plenty of time left. Oh, I actually put them there. Nice. Got his last kill. I should probably switch him. There we go. Oh yeah, that that poor, that poor guy got put in a really bad spot. Okay. 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 That position right there was not very good, but gonna uh, uh, fix my tag, they increase damage for a short time. Yeah, sure. So do I wanna go for two advanced combats or a combat and then an elite combat? Probably this way, because I can get that thing. Um, this guy's... These two are actually hurting pretty bad. Close of class, oh great. Trying to get kills with this guy is gonna be almost impossible. But yeah, I have to pair him up with the ballistic class because the ballistic guy doesn't do much damage. He's more of like, you know, he's supposed to be more of a tank. What happens with the audio? I don't know why the audio goes so quiet sometimes. I'm gonna switch their positioning to try to get this guy more kills. Because we're already on to wave 4 and he's only got 2 kills. Okay, we're gonna have to Clear the area and complete your objective. Acknowledged, relocating. Acknowledged, relocating.
Come on. Hit me my last kill. Nice. Finally was able to get it. Nice. So we got the objective. When any of your mixed kill and enemies look quite effective. Nah. Recover their damage is increased. Do I want to go from epic to legendary? Hmm. I don't really care that much. You know what? Let's actually go with that. Because while it doesn't really matter that much, it's going to at least get rid of it out of the pool of um, upgrades that I can get for the future. So while yes, that upgrade doesn't really do much for me, it at least removes it from the pool of upgrades that I could get in the future. Um, so hopefully it'll make way for upgrades that actually might actually be useful. And higher, higher level upgrades that might actually be useful. Where are you going, dude? Just quickly send him in to take out that guy and then move him back. That's awesome. That's awesome. Nice, okay. The speed at which this guy moves is just crazy. I love it. And this fire guy is gonna move down, and I want you to move there. So then he's not taking a ton of damage apart from the fire mech because fire mechs do increase damage against um, or no it's against explosive that they do increase damage and yeah. yeah, whatever it's fine literally says it at the top right or but Apparently, I am not able to open my eyes properly to see what it does. actually wasn't really that good of a reward from that. I'm surprised. I'm kind of surprised by how bad it was. But it's fine. Actually, yeah, since it doesn't really do much, we can...
move him up there. Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. Okay, there we go. Okay. Move you back to there. Yes, Commander. Acknowledged. Did I get it finished? Yeah. He could, yeah. I was gonna say, he, he moved fast enough, he could cross that. Nice. Actually, I'd probably put him there. He's got a nice big area to, that he can attack, so I'm not too worried about the explosive guy. Uh, I'm very worried about that, though. Oh my gosh. Um, okay, we're gonna send him in now. To melt through that. <laughs> One more wave. One more wave. Okay, we'll move him out of the way. Oh, move him out of the way. Move, move. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I forgot that he was there. But I still had him there. I think I could probably just leave him there. He just melts through all the enemies before they really even can get a shot off. Okay. Body, weapon, what do I need? You know what? We're just gonna... We're gonna buy it. Because why not? Because we can. <laughs> mm. That seems cool, but I don't think it's actually gonna be that good. But I feel like having damage when they land is going to be more important. Go with more charges, why not? Uh, what kind of body did... What happened? Why? That was weird. Okay. So what kind... Why is it doing that? Why is it opening up... That's a weird glitch. Ooh, they need to fix that. Okay. Yeah, you can... Is that... That does that with the campaign, too. Okay. Interesting. What kind of... I don't know what to do. Because you can... Yeah, that's weird. I can't and I can't check to see what kind of Oh, everything is oh, everything's broken. Everything everything's broken. Oh no. Yeah, let's try seeing if this fixes it. That's a very weird bug. Yeah, it's still broken. 
Uh oh. <laughs> Um, let's go back to the main menu, and then come back. Oh, I think my game is broken. Dang, that sucks. That really sucks. Okay, well, uh, I might just have to try closing out of the game and, like, and seeing if that fixes it, but I'll do that off, um, off camera, but yeah. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Brit and Valor 1949. Again, this is just a demo, so hopefully that bug does get fixed and stuff in the actual game itself. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed the, today's video. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. It mean the world to me. It doesn't cost you guys anything. And yeah, I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.